Pros note. The professional video training for softwares. Acrobiz. Check Pulse. Acrohost. For more videos, visit our website. www.sprosnote.com How to purchase fixed asset? Fixed asset means air condition, machineries, cars, like that, whatever one year above value items, it's called fixed asset. In Acrobiz, uh, easily you can manage the fixed asset purchasing. For example, some fixed asset you are purchasing as a credit, you are not you will not pay the amount and the, against the fixed assets there is the taxes also so you want to claim the tax also so it's easily can manage through acrobis let's see the procedure now i'm going to purchase a fixed asset on computer that is for my office use so first i need to create uh, one fixed asset you can click here heads and item or products and you can click uh, here for the new creating item same like our other all uh, goods and services similar like that you can create fixed asset also here you can click here new and i give the name dell desktop 3050 for example the model number also and a different language i'm not giving the part number barcode i'm not giving you know here mode of item here is the important selection you have to select here fixed asset then only it will post as a asset and the unit you can give what is the unit in my unit is piece and tax class will be 10 percentage there is no expiry date that's why disabled and if cost price you know here you can give otherwise on the purchasing time also you can provide the cost price so for example 300 is the cost price and sales price this is fixed asset i am not going to sell this one so no need other record fields just have seven plus so fixed asset is ready now i am going to purchase this asset so transaction and purchase and here i can select my party spectrum agencies okay the supplier bill number i can select it here supplier bill date if required i can give it here and the uh, item dell desktop 3050 i am going to purchase one piece so the rate is 300 and the tax will be 30 because uh, 30 is the tax, uh, 10 percentage, total 330. My fixed asset value is 300 and the additional 30 will be my tax. It will be claimed whenever I am going to claim the tax, it will return back. So my cost will be 300. I am going to save this entry. Whenever I save this entry, I have mode of payment. If I pay this 330 for the cash, I can select cash. From my bank account, I can select my bank account. No, this one, normally I didn't pay. Later on, I will pay. On the condition, I have the credit also. Just the entry posted. I make it as a credit. This is for the purchase below. If required, I can print out also. But now, I just close here. Now, I will check for my fixed asset value. So, I am going to check my dashboard. Here, dashboard. And financial status. You know, here, fixed asset will be increased. 300. 30 is 30 will be your payable also i will show here 300 i am checking i can check the statement also so automatically it's posted as a fixed asset this one done it now i will check for my payables you know here duty and taxes it will be increased together with that 30 will be added here also so i am just checking for last seven days i will show the entry You know, this is the 30. The purchase 16, 30 will be here. And now we'll check the trial balance also, how it's affecting for the trial balance. So here, uh, accounts, trial balance, and between period that will be okay. You will see here fixed assets. You know, this is your assets, cash, bank. You know, here fixed asset, Dell desktop will be 300. Thank you. Pros note. The professional video training for softwares. Acrobiz. Check Pulse. Acrohost. For more videos, visit our website www.sprosnote.com.